Contradiction's a big thing, isn't it? You know, what do you think about it? If you're part of a family, particularly as you were with the ex-royals, Harry and Meghan, you've gone on public television across the world basically saying that other family members are trapped. You know, you escaped. You didn't want to be part of it. But you're lucky, you know. You saw behind the velvet curtain. You managed to get out. But seemingly, of course, with Harry and Meghan, it's all about wanting to get back in behind that curtain because without it, seemingly they're nothing. That's the general public consensus. So it comes as a big surprise, does it really, about Harry and Meghan and exactly what they're requesting as they will they, won't they back here for the coronation. Quite frankly, people are sick to the back teeth because the bottom line is it's a security issue. That's the more concerning problem. But now it's not just about whether they will return. According to a very well-placed source and an excellent well-placed source, let me tell you, they really have put forward their demands for the newly named Prince Archie. Seemingly, whatever Prince George can do, Archie could do too. As ever, let me explain. Hi, good morning. Neil Sean here in the very heart of Kensington today. I hope you're keeping well. Lovely to have your company as ever. Hope you can hear the crows, yes, circulating. No, I haven't opened my wallet. How dare you? <laughs> it's only April, we don't open well July, you know that. I drew a tenner out in November, still stringing that out. Don't tell me we're all not the same. Is it, it do you find on a, a bit of a side note though, seriously, every note now, I don't know what it is saying dollars, but you say, say five, you know, months, six months ago, you might have been getting out 10 pounds. Now, seriously, at the checkout till supermarkets and stuff, it's 20 pounds, isn't it? Literally, all the shopping rounds up seemingly to a lot more money. Frightening situation we're all in here as ever. Back though to your breaking roll story of the day. Really, this centers upon the fact that seemingly, yes, as we now know, Prince George is going to have something of a pivotal role naturally, as this is his heritage that he's going to be partaking in on May the 6th for the coronation of King Charles III. Guess what? Meghan Markle wants similar. According to a very good source, she and Prince Harry believe that Archie, although doesn't really know any of his other relatives, anything like that, has seemingly also never been in such a huge public domain. They feel he could have some kind of pivotal role in this wonderful celebration. Personally, I feel sorry for the child because can you imagine if you've never ever really been in that sort of spotlight and literally you would have to be either by your father's side or indeed your mother. And we're not talking about just something small. They're basically looking at the role that Prince George has got and want something similar because they say that it will be part of his history. Absolutely rubbish because in the line of succession, unless it was an absolute catastrophe, uh, Prince Archie will be nowhere near that sort of role. But of course it's all about them and as I said at the start of this video, it's a strange thing to think, isn't it, that they wanted to get away, they wanted to leave because, you know, they didn't need the British monarchy. It was a terrible situation, almost racist in fact, they picked up an award uh, for uh, sort of rooting out racism within the monarchy. But now there's something to celebrate, now they need this money and as ever, you know, people say, are you being impartial? I'm speaking for the public here. This is seemingly what's coming back through. If you'd really truly started at an independent life, why would you want to keep coming back to something that you claim caused you so much hurt, uh, anxiety, grief, all of that sort of stuff? But of course now it's not necessarily about Harry and Meghan, it's about the R factor with Prince Archie. And according to that very good source, Meghan's not relenting and wants something for her son to make sure it is an historical event just for him and not necessarily just for, of course, those relatives like Princess Charlotte, Prince George and Prince Louis. Difficult times when you think really for King Charles because, you know, he's got the monarch's head on, the crown, but he's also got the father head on too. And a lot of people over here will really criticise him if he backs down on this situation. As yet, it's something that's still ongoing, a huge debate as one can imagine, over here developing story as ever when i know more you'll know more but what do you think do let me know in the comments below neil sean kensington london